scene is from The Man of Moat. Do not think in earnest it becomes you. Mm -hmm. Affectation is catching, I find. From your grave bow, I got it. <laughs> Where had you all that scorn and coldness in your look? From nature, sir. Pardon my want of art. I have not learned the softnesses and languishing which now embases are so much in fashion. <laughs> you need them not. You have a sweetness of your own, if you would, but calm your frowns and let it settle. <laughs> My eyes are wild and wandering like my But cannot yet be tied to rules of charming. <laughs> <laughs> Women, indeed, have commonly a method of managing those messengers of love. Now they will look as if they would kill, and anon they would look as if they were dying. They point and rebate their glances, the better to invite us. I like this variety well enough, but hate the said faces to say, Come, love me, a woman who at plays makes the so used to a whole audience, and at home cannot forbear. Oh, her oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Put on a gentle smile, and let me see how well it will become you. I'm sorry my face does not please you as it is, but I shall not be complacent and change it. <laughs> Though you are obstinate, I know it is capable of improvement, and shall do you justice, madame, if I chance to be at court when the critics of the circle pass their judgment, for thither you must come. And expect to be taken in pieces, have all of my features examined, every motion censured, and on the whole to be thought as but pretty or a beauty of the lowest rate. What think you? The women, nay, the very lovers who belong to the drawing room will maliciously allow you more than that. They always grant what is apparent. <laughs> that they may the better be believed when they name concealed faults they cannot easily be disproved in. Beauty runs as great a risk at court as wit does on the stage, where the ugly and the foolish are all oh! free to <laughs> <laughs> I love her, and dare not let her show it. I fear she has an ascendant toward me and may revenge the wrongs I have done her sex. <laughs> Madame, love will engage. You make me start. I had not heard to think to hear you speak of love. <laughs> <laughs> I never knew what was to have a settled ague yet, but now and then have had irregular fits. Oh, take heed. Sickness after long health is commonly more violent and dangerous. <sighs> I've taken the infection from her and feel it spreading in me. <laughs> Receive them. When your love's grown strong enough to make you bear me 